word full means containing or holding as much or as many as possible. Containing or holding as much or as many as possible. But I like this meaning. It says having no empty space. Having no empty space. God said, this is valley. Okay, please, you people, walk with me. This whole uh, stage, altar, is a valley. So imagine how beautiful it is looking right now. It's plain. It's plain. That's like it's smooth. Then he now says, this place that is smooth, fill it with ditches. No space. Don't give any space. That is full. One of the meaning. Having no empty space. So imagine this beautiful place you are seeing right now. Everything will now be boko boko boko. You know what it means? Ditches now. You dig, 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 and you just see like gutters, gutters everywhere. So everywhere now starts looking what messy. Everywhere starts looking what it doesn't look all put together anymore. And that's what he was saying. This is what will host. This is what is going to carry the supernatural. Ayaka bashakata. Hey, Akata. Let me not run ahead of myself, but I want to run ahead of myself. So because it is supernatural, it must defy the normal natural process. Because the normal natural process says that ditches should only be at the edge. This is only where you do ditch, either there or there, at the edge of the field, at the edge of the valley. But right now, God is saying, I don't care what they say about where ditches should be. My own is that, put it where? Everywhere. Let these ditches be everywhere. Imagine if the ditch was only at the edge, when the Moabites would have seen it. They would have seen it from far and said it's just water. But God knew that if he was going to do the kind of supernatural he wanted to do, then the ditches needed to be everywhere so that when they see it, it will look like what? A flood. It will look like blood. If it was only there, it would just look like water. But without them knowing why they were even instructed uh, to just do it everywhere, they obeyed. And they did what he said. Do you know what God is saying? When we talk about the supernatural, some of the things God will be doing is that he will give us instructions for us. The instruction is for ourselves. It will be for our benefit. It will be for our growth. But at the end of the day, uh, we become a terror to the kingdom of darkness. You don't understand. The, the information was for them. It was for them. Do it and I will fill the water because you know why? The water was for them. They were thirsty and they were afraid. If we are this thirsty and we are no, we don't satisfy our taste, we will be weak and this Moabites will kill us. So God was saying, you know what? So that because if they won, if the Moabites won them at this point, you will say it was not because it was fair. It will be because they were weak so they couldn't fight. So God was saying, you know what? I will give you water to satisfy your taste. But this water I am giving you will look like blood to your enemies. So what I am using to help you, what I am using to grow you, what I'm using to bless you, it will turn around uh, and be what will cause your enemies uh, to be defeated. Ayakata. Because you don't understand what God is about to do. Ayakata. Please, when he tells you pray, uh, please pray. It is always an add-on. Uh, when he says study the Bible, uh, please study. Uh, it is adding to you. Uh, everything we do in the spirit adds to you you are. It doesn't take from you. It makes you better. Because you know what? The more prayerful you become, the more of a terror you become to the kingdom of darkness. Ayakata. The more prayerful you become, uh, when you walk on the road, you see demons running away. You see things just leaving. Because it is you that is benefiting. But at the end of the day, it's as if at your benefit, uh, your growth uh, becomes uh, a weapon. Ayakata. Whether for mass destruction, whatever the weapon needs to become, it becomes when you pray Pray and you feel yourself. That prayer, Ayakata, becomes a favor when you go out. Ayakata, your children with favor. You enter places, people are granting you favor. Why are they granting you favor? It's because there is something you have been doing in the secret place. It's because the supernatural is at work. So when you walk on the road, it's not just you walking anymore. It's favor that is working. In Ayakata, opportunities are opening up. Helpers just want to help you. Why are they struggling to help you? It is the thing I did in the secret place that is causing this ripple effect to the people out there. Arakata. Can someone say, I live in the supernatural. I manifest the supernatural. I walk in the supernatural. Let your amen turn now. The louder your amen, let your answers come like that. <laughs>